Hi there. Would you like one of these in your map? What is this? It's a conveyor belt that brings all the good stuff from monster drops into my inventory. And what's the good, good thing about it is I do not have to do anything. Look what I've found. This, all this, all of these arrows, all of this stuff, they all came through this conveyor belt here and I did not have to do a thing. How is that possible? Well, okay, I lied. I had to do something and that something... is this. And this is a relatively small tower because you could build this really high up and I intend to do that but this is basically a tower with multiple floors in it and all those floors are dark and as you know darkness makes monsters spawn and when those monsters spawn they will get carried by water currents into this thing and this is what is called a mob grinder monsters go in they die and their loot stays uh, it does not get destroyed it uh, ends up dropping here and it goes into my conveyor belt system and it brings the loot to me so I can AFK in this system and get like my my machine here produces 500 items an hour but you can get it up to as high as maybe 7,000 items per hour depending on how high a tower you build but don't you think this is an abnormal amount of monsters spawning in the same area well it is and we have science to thank for that there's a g bunch of guys on minecraft forum that have worked out the algorithms of spawning monsters and they've come to an interesting conclusion that there is a special chunk in the Minecraft uh, world called the origin chunk or the 0.0, .0 chunk and that chunk will have the highest um, probability of spawning monsters there's a bunch of science to that and you can read it all yourself but we're just going to go with a fact that there is a 16 by 16 area called a chunk in the world reaching from the bedrock all the way to the sky that has a super should I say supernatural um, chance to spawn mobs and we want to build this tower on that chunk but you're asking me how do I find that chunk well I'm going to show you how Alright, so how do you find your origin chunk? Well, the answer is this. On Windows, you hit Windows key plus R to bring up the run prompt. And then you enter this thing here. It is percentage mark app data percentage mark slash dot minecraft. And this will bring you over to a screen like this. And this is the path for your Minecraft saves. And you open the saves file or the saves folder and you will find a bunch of different saves and right now let's say I want to find the origin chunk for world 2 so I'm going to delete world 5 because I do not need world 5 and if you don't have a world 5 yet then you're good but now just make sure you have a free world slot then copy world 2 and you know sort of duplicate the world in into this folder and then once it's copied you name it to world 5 or whatever world you just deleted so world 2 is the one I want to find the origin chunk in and world 5 is the duplicate of that and then once you do this you go into world 5 then 0 0 and you will find a full uh, a file called c.0.0.dat and then delete it it is gone and that you just deleted this origin chunk from world 5 and as you might have already guessed now if you, we use a program called cartograph which can fi be found uh, on the forums I'll have a link to it in the video description 
but we use cartograph which will make a map out of these two worlds and then once we've done that we compare them so first render world 2 on normal just hit render and it's gonna process it's gonna say done and then you will have a map I've got so many maps here so this is what popped out a map of world 2 so I'm gonna leave it here and I'm gonna go back into cartograph and I'm gonna render world 5 so remember world 5 was the exact same thing as world 2 but it had one chunk removed it's done and open up the map it just generated here we go put those two on top of each other and What's the difference when you switch between them? There's a chunk missing, right here. And that is your origin chunk. This whole area right here is the origin chunk. It's 16 by 16 blocks. And this is where you will have the highest chance of monsters spawning. So I'm gonna leave it to you to navigate to the origin chunk in your map. I'm not gonna teach you how to read a map, so this one you have to do on your own. But once you've found it, just build your tower there. And next, I will show you how you can build the tower, or what sort of floors you will need and how to make the actual mob grinder. But this is the area you want to build in for maximum monster spawns.